Hello, I'm Dennis C. Latham, and I am proving once again that Joe Hagler and Alva Lambert are pathological liars. Um, and I'm not going to say, I don't consider them to be racist, but what I will say they are, they are evil and wicked people. Um, I think you would consider them to, to be evildoers. That's what I would call them. I won't call them racist, but they do, um, for the um, popularity of society, they have racist tendencies, they have racist attitudes, um, but bottom line is I don't like to use the word too much anymore. I've been changing from that because I'm so used to using it because there's so much of it in Alabama in the South. Uh, I'm just going to call what it is, evil and wicked. They're evildoers. And ABC 32 is allowing them to be on their airways and they have a lot of sponsors. And we're going to see what those sponsors have to say in their support of racism or evil and wicked. Whichever one floats their boat. Now, in this episode here, this morning, uh, September the 13th, 2011, a uh, little after 6 o'clock this morning, a.m., um, Joe made a special announcement. He talked about it the first half hour to show that he was going to make a special announcement about 6 o'clock. Uh, about 6 8, 9, or 10, he made the announcement that him and Albert were racist. And as you'll see in the clip that Joe's, uh, I mean, Alva said that I was going to record it and put it on his YouTube. They don't even know how to talk right. That's how country they are. That's how evil and wicked they are. They don't have a good education. They don't have knowledge. They don't have wisdom. All they have is hatred, evil, and wickedness coming out of their mouths towards people. And they can never be wrong. That's the problem. But then they have a lot of sponsors. We're going to see what the sponsors think about this. Talk to you next time. Oh, one more thing. When are Americans going to start treating Americans just as well as they treat the military people from America? Don't we all need each other? I mean, if the America didn't exist, there'd be no need for the military. You know what I'm saying? So, don't we need each other? So, you know, let's start celebrating our Americans, the ones who are not in the military. Okay? Anyway, talk to you later. Can you believe this guy? He's a guy that dog cusses the sheriff, by the way. Here's a guy that, uh, little, hey, you, wh wh why do you watch this show to begin with? What's somebody, I don't want you on this TV show to call the show and say that I said in the past, white folks get suntans, which I like suntans, so they can draw a check. That's what's wrong with this country, people like you. You. You don't deserve to be an American. You don't deserve it, sir. It's 631. Stay tuned. A lot of white folks want to get darker because they can then draw welfare and food stamps. Oh, gosh. Why do white folks want to get darker? How come white folks want to get darker so they can draw welfare and food stamps? I still am. I don't, I'm, I'm laughing about it. Dennis Latham called the show and said that I said one day on this show, white folks get suntans to make them darker so they can get some government checks. This guy needs some help. I mean, he really needs some help. But let me say this, he ain't getting no help out of me. A lot of white folks want to get darker because they can then draw welfare and food stamps. Oh, gosh. Why do white folks want to get darker? How come white folks want to get darker so they can draw welfare and food stamps? Go ahead. You're on air. Okay. Um, uh, Albert, you brought up my name this morning. Uh, you said where I was going to talk. You put on the internet. Yeah, I figured you would, Dennis. Well, uh, you're the one that's down there and said, admitted that you all were racist. I mean, why, why would you even play with something like that? Hey, if, if... I knew that you'd react that way. Hey, do I look like a racist to you, Dennis? Uh, so, uh, that joke that you brought to the airways... Uh, white people get dirt tanned to collect welfare and uh, food stamps. What? What? Wait, what? What did you just say? The joke, the joke that you brought to the airways uh, not too long ago. You brought a joke there. And you said that white people get dirt to 
That's a total lie. You are a liar. Don't you ever call the show again, okay? Yes, call it. That's a total lie. I never said that. People get a suntan, white folks get a suntan to draw checks. That's he's, a total Did I misunderstand him? No. He's got us on the internet as Alva Lambert racist, Joe Hagler racist. That's a, you, hey, you're a liar? You're a scumbait in my book for saying that? Don't you call me again. Yes, call her. This may shock a lot of you, or it may not. But I guess it's time, after all these years on this TV show, to put the food on the plate here and admit to it. The two of us admit on this TV show this morning at 6.14, we are, in fact, racist. Do you have a problem with that? Does it shock any of you to learn the two of us are, in fact, racist? We're not a member of a KKK group. I don't, I don't mean that other Tea Party. No. But does it shock you to learn after all these years? A lot of you, you love us. But now, do you now? Do, do you now? Now think. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. And say, well, I, I did love those two guys. Or, or I like them, but, but now they're admitting to being racist? Do you have a problem with that? Dennis is going to record that and put it on his YouTube. <laughs> Dennis is going to record that and put it on his YouTube. <laughs> Dennis is gonna record that and put it on his YouTube. Dennis is gonna record that and put it on his YouTube.